break. Day, Day. 17. <laughs> How long have we been on this trip? Four? Yeah. Just four? Yeah. All right. Day four. And we are going to be doing some off-roading today. Like the other places was off-roading, I felt like. But today is, is going to be something unique. So we've got the van, the Jeep, the four-wheeler, and the side-by-side, -side, or the RZ, whatever they call it. And um, we're going to go park those things for a while and do some hiking in some unique places. Then, then we'll come back for those things and do the off-roading up to something called the Eternal Flame, which I guess is like a natural gas thing that's been burning for years, who knows. There's Mike trying to give the off-roaders a little bit of instruction. instruction. Yeah, you mean like it. You you drove that way farther than we had expected. <laughs> Why? We, we didn't know we were gonna go this far. Oh, I, I, well, I told you it's just the same. Everything's 20, 20 minutes further than it actually was claimed to be. <laughs> <laughs> All right, is your mouth numb? <laughs> Frozen. A little bit. Look at that house. Actually, it feels, it feels good when you're going around the curve and there's the, the you sun see shining. The sun. It feels really nice, but then you get back to the woods and it's freezing. <laughs> This is only four miles, but it, oh my gosh. And the bumping around of the phone, is it because I'm shaking? No, she's a, she's a steady as <laughs> But she we met, we met Ma Henry, who owns the grocery store. Now we're gonna put those in air quotes. <laughs> grocery store. Jack. And, <laughs> Jack. And uh, <laughs> she's smoking a cigarette in one hand and puffing an inhaler in the other. <laughs> yeah, she's something. Oh, oh, so, Trez, what's your perspective? <laughs> well, we've been on this road for about 23 and a half miles. That used to be four miles. We took too many turns to even count. And uh, it looks like we're going up the mountain, and down the mountain, and up again. And we've crossed over what looks like a the 15th Baptist oh, Church in the middle of nowhere. Look here, we found oh, what in the world. Oh my goodness. Civilization. But look at the road we have to get there. That's about the road that we've been traveling on. For... We took the road less traveled. Oh, all right. Oh my God. Oh my God. We're gonna stop here over this bridge and let one of them boys take it. Have an experience. We haven't had cell reception for over probably an hour. <laughs> That's how far out we are. How many? Just four. Four minutes. Four minutes of no reception? Yeah, just four. No, no. Like a whole hour. No, like I have nothing. Oh, it was supposed to be just for four minutes, I think is what Ireland is saying. anymore. <laughs> We've officially... We, we thought we were there like, well, maybe we are. Maybe I don't know how many Texas? minutes ago. Michigan, Hours ago. Oh, we don't know if we're in Kentucky, <laughs> Tennessee anymore for sure. The moral of the story. 
Mike's four miles is... I think we're in Arizona right now. <laughs> I think we are. So we drove a long way and unfortunately the place that we were going is closed. They've shut it all down. But this used to be the old coal plant where they would wash the coal from the mountains and then they'd load the steam engines with the coal. And the big engine that's obviously that not working anymore is is a quarter mile out that way that we can't see and they've shut it all down with no trespass he loved me ere i knew him and all my love is due him he plunged me to victory beneath the fancy wood amen highlight of the trip getting $25 or cents candies and toys what'd you get Riley can I have I got monkey all of these are monkeys except not sure what this is Maybe like a kiln. This is another bathroom? Or this is like a... Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is the top of the general store down there where somebody probably used to live. Is now probably abandoned. Wow. Holy cow. God, thank you for the opportunity to be gathered here in this next new place for us. We pray that you bless our time and our food and all the Okay, so what Mike was saying is the school bus comes down this drive and then normally crosses over the river here, but if the water is too high, gets too high over this crossway, then the kids have to walk that suspension bridge, and I don't know if you can see it through the trees, over to the bus over here. And we're going to walk the suspension bridge in just a little bit. This might have been maybe where they sold some of the pieces to fire in the kiln. You can see through there, the pieces that you paint, maybe where the kiln came from. I don't know how well you can see through there, but. Looks pretty cool in there at one time. Obviously you can't go in there anymore because it's all boarded up and run down. It was called the Blue and White Service Station. Is that real? No. Can I take it? No. Turn around. Look at us. We're in the middle of the river. Hi, baby girl. So we're walking the abandoned railroad track. And we're headed to the water tower up there. Why is this here? 
So look at this. Oh my god. Big, big. I'll get out of the way so they take a picture. There's the water tower and out that pipe is where they'd fill the trains with. Do you want to say something? That's the water tower and it's really scary. New vehicle now. We are in the Jeep. There are four kiddos in the back. <laughs> we got the tires aired down or unaired, deflated, whatever word you want to use. And we are off roading in There's a few. Three in the side by side and three on the quad. First through the water. We got to go through the water now. Mike got through. Not gonna make it through here. <laughs> yeah. I'm supposed to do. <laughs> okay. Second huge. Is that fun? <laughs> oh, there's more, mommy. There's more. Ow. Ow. Here we go. Ow. Oh, my biggest water part so far. Mike just taught Trez how to do it. So let's see. Here we go. That's what you do. Oh my gosh. We're not going across it. We're going in it. Yeah. I want to go in there. <laughs> oh, I think he's seeing it. Maybe, yeah. Maybe he's testing it out. Did he wave them on? I think they're saying, yeah, it's fine. It's getting deeper. Oh my gosh. They're almost sinking. I don't know about this. So, I think the river was too high and so we can't take the other two vehicles through so they're coming back are you driving through the Yeah, I saw those, yeah. 
It's fun in here too, okay guys? Is it? Yeah, it's fun. It was Alright, so we turned around. The four-wheeler made it, but just by the skin of its teeth, the exhaust was bubbling. We were, they were so underwater. So they said the RZR would not have made it, and the Jeep maybe. So we decided it was too much risk, and now we've turned around to go back. We switched some riders.
time we were going to build a house down here. 